hi in this video we will learn about how we can create a setup or exe file of c sharp project with sql database so first of all let me delete my existing database i have deleted my database this is my project that i have built and the database of this project is here in my sql so here i have tables in my database let me show you okay so they're taking time so yeah so let me run the application I will show you how it's working So here I let me put some data. Data is added successfully. So let me show you. TBL customer yeah this is the data that we just submit first of all let me delete all the data from the database so yeah now I have the empty database with with no records so right click on database click on task and deattach the database will be dhat attached from sql server now go to visual studio and web app dot config so here is your connection string that contains our server name that is our sql server so first of all we will make a copy of it after copying we will comment the above yeah so in this connection string we have to change some things we have to make the database as local database so here is our data source I will put the, that in your uh, in, in video description so you can just replace it I have just selected and paste it yeah so in this connection string you just have to change the database name here will be your database name so I will copy the database name and paste here so what it will do it will go to your application directly where directly where your application is installed and there it will find the database file so we have to add database file here so for that right click on databases click on attach add and find this path copy the path and open that path here here you will see your database just copy these both files db task management mdf and ldf copy both files just close it and paste in project so yeah here is our database file let me just test if error comes that means our database is not connected properly no okay so our application is ready so now i will show you how you can create the setup 
right click on project go to properties click on application here you will be able to add the path uh, add the icon of the application i have downloaded icon from from the internet and i have added here so click on publish here you will give the path of the directory where you want your your setup to be saved so i have added the path here and click on publish so yeah this is our application ready so so one thing you have to remember uh, you have to install local database on your computer if local database is not installed on computer it will not work so for this you have to go on google and you will uh, write uh, local db 2019 sql local db 2019 so you will go to the site i will also provide the link and download this you have to download this after you have downloaded this you have to install it and your application will start working so i will provide both connection string and that url as well so let me just test it click on setup so i have not installed sql 2017 so i will click on accept it will download it from internet and will install it i have added sql in prerequisite how you can add some things in prerequisite click on prerequisite and here you, here you can add the things you want to be installed before application so here i have checked for sql server 2017 so that's why it's downloading and installing before our application get installed click on yes it's installing sql server on your system Click on install, no application will be installed. The application has been installed successfully. So if you want to run, just go and search otherwise it will be automatically start so here is our application that we installed so we can add some data so if you click on insert it will be added into our database okay that's it for now if you have any questions just let me know thank you bye bye